Hello everyone, this is Mother Crow. It's been a long time since I did a garden tour video and we've actually moved since the last one. So let me show you what I've got growing at our new place. And I'm starting inside because we have an indoor garden and a couple outdoor gardens. So let me show you what's growing in our windowsill garden first. So here you have our sink garden and this is mostly just cabbages and kales and all of those greens but we do have one little apple sprout that sprouted from an apple we got at the store and some marigolds up here. They're just young seedlings in this little window garden, as well as some house plants. There's just a few house plants. These are uh, arrow, um, arrowhead, I believe is the name of them, house plant. They just root in water, so we just have them sitting in water here. I have some tomato cuttings here as well, also getting roots and water. This one's ready to go out in the main garden. And there you have it. That's our little window seal garden. Here you have our little porch garden. Okay, this is our mushroom farm right here that's used from an old mushroom kit, and I just keep it covered so it has more shade. So that's what this piece of cardboard does. Then we've got some peppers here. These are all habanero peppers. These ones are serrano peppers here, and then these are um, Anaheim pepper, which I've never grown Anaheim pepper before, so we'll see how that does. We also have tomatoes, lots of tomato plants still. I have a bunch in the garden too outside, so you'll see these are most of these are ready to go in the ground. There's another pepper here. This one's either a bell pepper or a habanero though, because it was planted earlier, and I just can't remember what it was. And then I have some basil plants here as well, and that's our little porch area. Here you have our front garden. It's not very big and we don't have a lot growing, but it's still nice. This is our zucchini plant. We've got some young zucchini fruits on there. And then we've got some beans. Um, some of them died from the heat in the summer. There's some lamb's quarters here, which makes a great spinach substitute. And then more beans, green beans on there, green beans on there. And I just planted some fresh green beans back here. So we'll see if they come up. And then here I've got a sunflower growing. A honeysuckle bush and then some wild strawberries or mock strawberries and a radish. Here you have our back garden. This is our last garden bed. It's not very big or fancy yet. We've just moved here about a we moved here in May and it's now July so we haven't really had time to fix it up more than this and a lot of stuff we planted on this side just didn't grow but our tomatoes here are doing really good. We even have some small fruits on some of these, like this one here in the front, I believe, had a little baby tomato on there this morning. So the tomatoes are doing really well. We also have some pumpkin sprouts here that came up in the compost and a little pepper here. But all of these are tomatoes and they're a mix of beefsteak tomatoes, Roma tomatoes, and cherry tomatoes. See that little white stuff? That's all eggshells. This is our big pumpkin. I believe it's going to be a white pumpkin, but I'm not 100% sure. We've got to let it grow and see for sure. It came up through our compost. We are using um, some chicken compost from my uncle's farm, as well as some chinchilla compost from our chinchilla. Technically, it's my sister's chinchilla, but hey, we take care of it, so I guess we can say it's ours. All right. concludes our garden tour video. I hope you enjoyed this content and if you did please give me a comment and feel free to subscribe to this channel. I'll be hopefully doing more videos like this again uh, at least once a month um, and of course I do tarot readings as well as psychic services and I've been doing a lot of coaching and mentorship through that as well so you can find me on Facebook if you're interested in any of that content. It's uh, Mother Crow Tarot on Facebook. I also have a Patreon which is Mother Crow on Patreon and then of course this YouTube channel. Please continue to follow me, subscribe and, and check out the rest of my content. Thanks for watching.